Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here, sharing another glitch that I found. This one lets you farm air assassinations. You can keep doing air assassinations on the same enemy over and over, getting over 100 XP each time. And I'm using the XP boost. If you're not, your numbers will be different. This is at the Trade Depot in Jorvik. I also have a guide for another XP glitch in East Anglia that is even more efficient in terms of XP farming since it involves killing three high level enemies instead of one. I'll link that in the description. But this one I'm showing you now here in Jorvik is cool because it uses air assassination like this, which is a staple of the Assassin's Creed series. Reminder to subscribe to my channel if you're not already to see more videos like this and get tips and tricks you won't find anyplace else. So how this works is after killing all the enemies in the building, set trap on the captain of this outpost, the Woebringer. He's the one with the cape and the two-handed axe that we just killed here. So set trap, then pick up the body and throw it into the cage nearby. Or if you've already killed the cat like I did here, you have to exploit it with your weapons. But I learned that it's better to not kill the animal and throw the body into it to explode it. And then when we come back, that enemy, along with the animal in the cage, will both have respawned. So now we're going to exit the trade depot. Here I'm doing it through the roof, but I think it's actually more efficient to go out the side door. So once you get out of combat, jump over this fence, you want to save your game and then reload the save you just made. And then when you go back into the trade depot, that Woebringer enemy that we just air assassinated, well, the second enemy we air assassinated, will come back to life. <laughs> and that is the glitch. So where are we again? We're at the trade depot in Jorvik, right near the Jorvik Harbor. Jorvik is in the northern part of the map, surrounded by Jorvik Shire. So for this to work, there are two skills you'll need from the Raven skill tree. And there we see the Woebringer with the two-handed axe, as well as the lynx in the cage near him have both respawned. So in order to assassinate this high level enemy, you'll need the advanced assassination skill from the Raven skill tree. Although for some reason it didn't trigger on this one. It's that orange circle that comes up, so you have to do the timing-based assassination. So the advanced assassination is the first skill you'll need from the Raven skill tree, and then the second is Exploding Corpse, which lets you set trap on a dead body to load it with explosive power and damage any enemies that come near it. So you don't have to kill that animal, but if you do, you get a little extra XP and leather and you can get out of combat quicker and then do your save and reload and do it again. I'll do it one more time to just show you they keep respawning. And once you get going with this farm, this area is off limits. I can do around four cycles in five minutes for about 500 XP, which again, isn't the most efficient, but it's not bad. And it sure is fun to do these air assassinations. It never gets old. So the enemy did respawn, but don't forget to set trap and explode the corpse before you exit the building 
And then before you re-enter the building, save your game and then reload. And it should keep repeating. This is Amber. Subscribe to my channel for more guides and gameplay for Assassin's Creed Valhalla.